Hello everyone, it's Allie from Titan and welcome back to our channel. I am here with our fourth and final signature series opening of the day. This time we do have one 2022 top Star Wars signature series hobby box to check on out for Talvaldis R from California. So thank you so much Talvaldis for letting me open up this hobby box for you. And I hope to find you an awesome autograph to add to your collection. Now if you all aren't familiar with this product, we've checked out quite a bit. So if you want to see more, make sure you click that playlist at the end of the video. But just inside these boxes is one encased autograph card and that's it. So, hope to find an awesome autograph here to add to Talvaldis' Star Wars collection. So I'm excited to go ahead and get on into this box. We've seen some low numbered stuff here this afternoon. Did check out a total of five other boxes already. So hoping to end off on a high note here with this final recorded break of the day. So let's go ahead and just jump on into this box here by snapping us into the corner. Let's grab Tiny Knife. Let's also grab our oversized team bag. Make sure to go ahead and get that in case autograph sleeved on up so that way the case itself does not get any more scratches or any scratches at all. Sometimes they come out of the box not so fresh, which I don't understand how it happens, but it's with every product that's encased any company. There's always some, some of the encased, whether it's like a slab or actually just a magnetic where it's, I don't know, but hopefully Fingers crossed, nothing wrong per se with this magnetic, but of course there's different polishes that can be used to buff out any cosmetic iffiness on magnetics. But all right, very quick opening here. Let's just see what we're gonna have for Taldvaldus. We have, do, 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 do have base autograph, new signer for this product, Richard Brake as Valen Hess. Richard Brake, to me, I remember when we first pulled a Valen Hess in our case opening for release day, we opened a full case for the shop. I was like, I can't remember. I've heard this name before. It is the Night King from Game of Thrones. And I was like, ah, oh, yeah, someone in the comments let me know. There's a couple different Blakes in the Star Wars universe, like Masa Meda is played by a Blake, a couple different others, but I was like, Brake sounds familiar. So it is the Night King here from Game of Thrones. Also that snotty Imperial officer, right? That got shot by by Mayfield, right? I haven't actually seen The Mandalorian, as I uh, begrudgingly have to admit, just it has, I haven't had time, I know. Shame, Allie. Allie, how can you collect Baby Yoda cards and have never seen the show? Oh, I'm just, I'm just a degenerate. I need, I need Star Wars cards. Even if I haven't seen the specific show. I've seen one episode of the Book of Boba Fett. <laughs> I know what happens. I've seen all the spoilers. I just haven't had time to sit down and watch it. But like I said, new signer here, just the base version here though, for Taldvaldis, but Richard Brake as Valen Hass. And a little bit, I know this is gonna sound weird, but his autograph I feel is a little more detailed than usual. Usually has just a loop in the middle. I know not everyone loves the way that he signs, which I see the complaints, but also that if that's how he signs, that's how it is. It's like that on Game of Thrones cards as well. Some people do shorten their autograph for stickers, but this is just how he signs in general. Like I said, a little bit more detailed than usual. Well, it's base autograph here, Richard Brake as Valen Hess for Taldvaldis. So thank you so much for letting me open up a Star Wars Signature Series box for you here on the channel. Really hope you enjoyed this very, very quick opening and love this new addition to your collection. And yes, that does it here for our Signature Series openings of the day. We do have a lot of boxes in our queue for tomorrow night's live stream. Have a couple boxes on the schedule, I believe, for Monday or Tuesday next week, but otherwise we are almost out. Can't believe we went through so much signature series so quickly. So if you guys are craving more signature series openings, there's still some more to come, but it'll be over by the end of next week if I had to guess. But with that, that does it here for this video. So I hope all of you out there watching enjoyed it as well. If you did, don't forget to go ahead and hit that like button. Comments, drop those for me down below. And if you're not yet part of the Titan Cards family, we'd love to have you join us. Make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Also, before I get out of here and start prepping for that Opichi Hockey live stream later this afternoon, do I have to give a big shout out to all of our channel members. Thank you so much, you all, for going above and beyond with your support. Bossman and I truly do appreciate it. Do you have 13 Black Label fans? And in Bounty Hunter Breaks, Chris Rivers, D Vaughn, Epicenter Gaming, Fails Tales, Kira Soltari, Mark Mardini, Mike Clotis, MT, Sean F., Stephen Olivo, and Stephen Bly. We also do have nine Gem Mint fans. Marco Verrer, Dusty Archuleta, Judge Geek, Jonathan Scott, Michael C, Michael Bigelow, Scorecard Collectibles, Shinef Sen, and William Hastings. But thank you so much again to all of our channel members. And all members do have their names shown on screen at the end of every video. But yes, let me go ahead and pack up these signature series orders, make some space for some, some boxes to be able to contain all that OPG hockey in just a little while. So thank you so much for watching, everybody. Take care, stay safe, and I'll catch you all 
the next video. Bye!